Now your Storm Track 7 forecast on KWWL. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Joy Bettenhausen. If you're waking up with us right now, you can see some cloud cover beginning to funnel into our area here. You can see that's all because of that storm system just out west of western Iowa there. Other than that, we are only seeing some clouds. Threat Tracker does show that for today, we're under a heat advisory. That's for all of eastern Iowa. Tomorrow, though, we've got some scattered strong storms that will be possible, and those storms will kind of bleed into Monday morning there, but finally clear out by Monday afternoon. So let's focus on this heat advisory. It is for all of eastern Iowa, and it goes until about 8 p.m. today night. That means that we could see heat index values of 105 degrees or more across the area today. So if you have to be outside, make sure to wear some loose fitted clothing as well as to, of course, stay hydrated. Comfort level does show today and tomorrow going to be humid. We'll be in the mid to upper 70s for our dew points, so that's going to definitely feel awful. But as we start our work week, we're back into the mid 60s, so finally getting a little bit of a break from that there. Future track does show we'll have mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies for much of our morning there. Not too bad to start off the weekend, but we could have a couple isolated showers and thunderstorms later on this afternoon into the evening hours here. I do think future track is kind of overdoing this chance here. This should mainly stay in our northern half of our viewing area, but wouldn't be surprised if maybe a stray shower or two ended up further south. That does clear out late Saturday. However, early Sunday morning, we're going to have a system kind of graze our northern viewing areas. Now, really won't see that further south there. That'll move through, but this is just a start. We've got even more rain chances to talk about for later Saturday, Sunday afternoon into the evening hours. Today, though, we'll be in the low to mid 90s. It'll feel hot and humid out there, so if you don't have to be outside, you might want to stay inside in the air conditioner. Tonight, not getting much relief. Low to mid 70s again. Pretty humid out there feeling quite warm. City by city forecast shows Waterloo and Dubuque got about a 20% chance for an isolated shower storm. Cedar Rapids and Iowa City won't really see that. However, all of us will see the rain on Sunday. Again, a couple strong storms will be possible as those move into Monday morning as well. We get a little bit of a break from the rain pretty much Monday afternoon till about Wednesday morning and temperatures staying in the low to mid 80s for most of next work week. And it looks like hanging on to the mid 80s for next week as well.